Well, in fact, I would say that uh, even though I was motivated in public affairs, if you want to say in a broader way, uh, to be specifically involved in politics, that, that is simply because of Pinochet. At uh, the time of the coup, uh, I was uh, a professor at the university, and at the same time, I was uh, the Secretary General of the Latin American Faculty of Social Sciences. Social Sciences was just the beginning in Chile, and UNESCO, the United Nations Education Brand, uh, decided to have an institute devoted to social science, and I was appointing, appointed the Secretary General of that. It's true also that President Allende asked me to be uh, his ambassador to Moscow, to the Soviet Union. During those days, uh, it was necessary to have the approval by Congress, by the upper chamber, the Senate. And at the time of the coup, there was no ambassador in Moscow, in Washington, in Paris, in La Habana, simply because there was a, not a complete agreement between Agenda and Congress. So at the time of the coup, I, I was supposed to be ambassador, and nevertheless, uh, I never went to Moscow till many, many years later when I arrived to Moscow, but as a president of Chile, and the Soviet Union didn't exist anymore. <laughs>